we're at Growing Underground and we are a commercial urban farm, 33 metres under London's high streets. We're growing about 15 different microherbs. Um, they go out separately into the food service market, but they also get blended together to create what we call a dinner party salad. So a high-end, uh, full of flavour, wonderful product for the uh, retail market. We went with LED lighting because the, we'd seen an evolution over the last sort of seven, eight years, moving from high pressure sodium lights uh, through to LED lights. One, because, because we're a sustainable business and, and all of our energy for this farm comes from renewables, we wanted to find the lowest uh, uh, energy uh, lighting system that we could find. Inevitably, that led us to LED lighting. But also, what was a significant factor was the heat. Uh, the lack of heat coming off the lights, we wouldn't be able to grow this close together with high pressure sodium, for example. So the advances in LED technologies, the advances in the light spectrums, the great quality of the flavours and the products that were coming out, that was the reasons that we went with LEDs. Initially we ran a series of tests uh, during our research and development phase. We looked at about six to eight different light manufacturers and we found that um, throughout all of the testing, whether it, was the, whether it was the yield that we were getting, whether it was the flavours that we were getting, whether it was the support and the service, every single time we chose Valoya because they were absolutely tip top. The, the light spectrum is one of the, the clear differentials between Valoya and other manufacturers and we just found in terms of the balance across a range of products and the yields and the flavours that we got across that range of products instinctively led us to, to purchase the Valoya Light. 